music and lost in the Bob McGillian. Word of healing. Welcome everybody to another episode of the Bob McGillian International Bible Radio Show. We got a blockbuster lesson for you, sister. Man. Through your Thank you for joining us on this Thursday. We hope everybody had a good week and having a good week. Man, really, really special lesson for you tonight. Team Bombers in the house. What time is it, y'all? What time is it? What time is it? Welcome, 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 sisters and brothers, to another edition of the Bob McGilead Internet Radio, coming to you live from the Israel and God Studios here in Riverdale, Illinois. Right. It is an awesome thing to be sitting here before you today, sisters and brothers. And uh, to my right is my teacher today, our teacher today. Yes. yes Brother yes. Julius. Huh? Yes, Brother Julius. Me? Yes. Okay. Brother Julius. Praise the Lord. Lord sisters Jesus. and brothers. I failed to introduce myself. I am your host tonight, Brother Will. Uh huh. And to his right, yes. To Brother Julius, right, is our reader for tonight, Brother Ray U. Ben. Elder. Woo. In the house. God. We got a, another fellow teacher in the house, Brother Jeremiah. In Jeremiah the in the house. We got Latoya Neal in the building. Hi, Latoya. Uh, Brother oh, she right there. is oh. in the building. Nicodemus. Right. Sister Debbie is in the building. Debbie. And it's we got Sean, partner. which is on the. Instrumentals. <laughs> Sean on the keyboard. Sean on the keyboard in the building. Man, shout out and to... And we got our little producer, Moshe. Moshe. In the building. Look at Moshe throwing them up. The stones. Yeah. Much love, Mo. We give a shout out to Brother Hoover and Brother Yaman, the executive producers of the show. Yes. Sisters and brothers, we have an awesome show that the Lord allowed us to put together tonight. When I say the Lord allowed us to put together, because yes, sisters and brothers, when we put these lessons together... Is being led by the Holy Spirit. Yes, sir. Well, I don't want you to think that we take anything upon ourselves to think that we put these lessons together. Yes, the sir. Lord puts these lessons together yes. uh, according to what he wants to get out, sisters and brothers. So if yes. anybody be offended tonight because of this lesson, be offended enough to research and change. There's going to be some offenses, brother. Because the book Jesus says necessary offenses must come, right? Must come. Must come. Yes. Because it's a, it's a group of people out here, sisters and brothers, that don't believe that all nations have the ability and access to be saved. Right. And I say ability and access because we know some not going to be saved, Julius, because some don't want to repent. So, but the Especially Lord, those of the circumcision, Will. That's right. But the Lord has given us access back to the tree of life, mm. which is himself, not other than Jesus, sisters and brothers. Yes. And we have to take advantage of that. So, to get right into it, the title of today's lesson is what, Brother Julius? The Conversion of the Gentiles. That is the title tonight of this episode, The Conversion of the Gentiles. And... As we go on in the show, we're going to show you who the Gentiles actually are and why they rule everything, sisters and brothers. Not only that, Will. Not only so, that, Ray. Not only that, Ray. We're going to show you that they, too, will have access to the kingdom of God as well as the rest of the so, sons of Noah. So, so yeah. as I read this title, Julius, it's, it's something I'm hoping that you could debunk okay. tonight. I'm okay. hoping that you could debunk that the, the theory that if you're not a Jew, you're a Gentile. We're gonna we're gonna start off debunking that one. We're gonna debunk that, right? Yes. So I want to debunk that because as I grew up in the Sunday church, uh, -huh. uh, uh and I and I grew up and I came here with this little guy at nine years old. Yes. I was always taught in the Sunday church if you're not a Jew, you're a Gentile. Yes. And I was taught I was a Gentile. All we coming up from a I've child heard to nine years old, I was taught I was a Gentile. I heard that. And I taught I was taught that the Jews were the ones that we call the Edomites, but mm. that's not what they were teaching back then, sisters right. and brothers. But we're going to show you. Uh, Julius, give us a, a definition of what the word conversion well, means. Well, what I want to do, Will, I want to do, I want to open up with our prayer. Okay. I want to thank the, the uh, all of our social media, the top fans, the Bomb of Gilead fans, and newcomers. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the Bomb of Gilead uh, Bible Radio Show. Welcome to the Truth Hour. Bible Radio Show hosted by Black Ice and the Messenger. Welcome all social media outlets. And because of the length of the lesson, uh, we love you. We thank you for tuning in. Like, please share. Share, yes. And 
post. Will, Isaiah 61. Isaiah 61 and 1 reads. Go ahead, brother. The spirit of the Lord God is upon me. Yes. Because the Lord has anointed me to preach good tidings unto yes. the meek. Yes. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted. Yes. To proclaim liberty to the captives. Yes. And the opening of the prison to them that I bound. Praise the Lord. To proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord. Yes. The day of vengeance of our God. Yes. To comfort all that mourn. Yes. To appoint unto them the morning Zion. Yes. To give unto them beauty for ashes. Yes. The oil of joy for mourning. The garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness. Man. That they may be called the trees of righteousness. That they might be called. You don't see nowhere in Israel where it says Israel. It says that they might be called tree, tree, uh, tree, trees of righteousness, Will. And the planting of the Lord. Yes. That he might be glorified. Man. May the Lord add a blessing to the reading of his word. That was uh, Isaiah 61st chapter 1 through uh, 3. Now, sisters and brothers, uh, we might go over a little bit on this lesson. I don't want to cut nothing. I really want, this is heavy on my heart because I have people on my job who I talk to daily, and I have people on the street who really, and there's a popular teaching that's going on that the Gentiles should not have salvation, that they should not be uh, saved. And sisters and brothers, when you call into the chat rooms, let us know what city, town, state, municipality you from. And again, we thank you, Jeff, for tuning in. We know that there are games and stuff going on, but guess what? That's why they have this. Why here is about eternal life. Sister, this is about eternal life. So as we get into lessons, sisters and brothers. We also want to pray for all the children and all our our, our, our loved ones and all the people out there that be in human traffic, sister. Man, brothers. Uh, we Man. our hearts go out to these people, Man. and we pray and we ask that you don't become victim and a victim to this, sister yes. and brothers, by setting yourself up to doing this service mm -hmm. for people. And we're gonna read we're gonna we're gonna talk about this and we got a lesson we putting together, sisters and brothers, yes. about this subject. Man. Well I wanna first of all, Ray you Ben is gonna do me the honor and the privilege of reading. Thank you, my brother. And sisters and brothers, if I become a little bit uh emotional or passionate, <clears throat> it's a right passion. That's right. So I gotta caution you, some, if not many, will be offended. But we're going to read out of the this book, this book right here, that the Lord had written, which is his book. And if it's not written in the book and somebody didn't add it or took it away, shame on you. That's, That's all right. I got to say. That's right. Without further ado, the title of the lesson tonight is The Conversion of the Gentiles. The theme of this lesson, Will, is to show that through prop, proper, proper, that's righteous, biblical teaching. The descendants of Noah's son, Japheth, the Gentiles, will also obtain salvation through their faith and obedience to God's holy word, and that they too will be joint heirs with Christ as promised to the rest of the sons of Noah. That's right. Now, I normally don't do scripts, but I, I did this one because this is near and dear, and it's heavy on me, sisters and brothers, and I got to share it because... The book said that there are brothers that are teaching things that ought not to be taught, you know, and bringing, them, bringing themselves damnation. Uh, damnation upon themselves right. if they don't accept what's written. That's right. Now, it is a widely taught statement that if you are not a Jew or Jewish, then you are a Gentile or a non-Jew. This is a great error. This is a great error. When you look at Wikipedia or you look at uh, uh, definition, it would say Gentiles, non-Jews. We're going to debunk that right here, right now, tonight, on this episode. Now, it's a great effort that we will prove directly out of the scripture themselves. In order to begin our correction, we must start with what the Lord himself commands us to do. In 1 Thessalonians, the 5th chapter, verse 21, it states, prove all things, hold fast that which is good. Also, that which is written written in John, the fourth chapter, I'm sorry, 1 John 4 and 1. Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirit, whether That's they right. be That's of right. God. That's right. And lastly, again, what Paul stated in 2 Timothy, the fourth chapter, he said, preach the word, be instant, in season, out of season, reprove. That's what this lesson is about. That's this right. episode is about reprove, rebuking, and exhorting with all long suffering and doctrine, and making full proof of the ministry. That's right. Our intent is not to def offend any, but to rightly divide the words of truth. And in the end, to understand that the God of Israel is no respecter of person. And we're going to read that as the chief apostle Peter reminds us in Acts 10, 34, 35, but in every nation, and I'm quoting, but in every nation, 
he that feared God and worketh righteousness is accepted with him. That's right. This statement alone debunks the teaching that only Israel shall be saved and will begin in Genesis, the first chapter. So bend your phones, uh, your Bibles. Phone, and Bible. if you like what you're hearing, sisters and brothers, send us them praying hands, send us them uh, emojis. emojis, send us <laughs> everything. And if you dislike it, we glad to hear from you. We got people in the Bomb and Gilead team. Bomb is waiting to answer your questions in the chat room. And if we can't get to you directly, we will get to you eventually. So now, without further ado, Genesis, uh, Genesis, 1 or, uh, Genesis, Genesis chapter 9. Okay. Genesis, 9. Genesis chapter 9. Okay. Genesis chapter 9, Brother Ray, and we're going to read verses 1 and 2. Now, in order to understand, we got to go back to the beginning. Now, the Lord told Adam, be fruitful, multiply, and replenish the earth. Adam was not an Israelite. That's right. It is not written. It don't even tell you what color he is. He just said, multiply, be fruitful, and replenish the earth. Genesis 9, verses 1 and 2. And God blessed Noah and his son. Yes. And say it unto them. Yes. Be fruitful and multiply. Yes. And replenish the earth. And replenish the earth. The same thing that he told Adam. Go ahead. And the fear of you. Yes. And the dread of you shall be upon every beast of the earth. Yes. And upon every fowl of the air. Yes. And upon all that move upon the earth. And yes. upon all the fishes of the sea. Yes. Until your hand. They are delivered. Until right. your hands, they are given. That is all the sons of Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. Continue at verse 7 and 8, Ray. When you get it, go ahead, brother. And you, be ye fruitful and multiply. Uh -huh. Bring forth abundantly in the earth and multiply therein. Man, go ahead. And God spake unto Noah unto his sons with him, saying, uh -huh. And I will behold, I will establish my covenant with you and with your seed after you. And with you, he told the sons of Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. It is a, it is a myth that if you're not a Jew, you are a Gentile. Mm -hmm. it's, that's a, that is a myth. Skip down to verse 13, brother, and read it. I do set my bow in the cloud. Yes. And it shall be for a token of a covenant between me and the earth. Listen, the rainbow shines on every nation and everywhere, even in Alaska, sisters and brothers. They got the northern lights up there. But the bottom line is God's sun and moon and rain, it rains on everybody, sisters and brothers. That's right. Absolutely everybody. Verse 15, Ray, come on. And I will remember my covenant, which is between me and you and every living creature of all flesh. Yes. And the water shall no more become a flood to destroy all flesh. He never said he would not destroy some flesh. He said all flesh, mm -hmm. sisters and brothers. 18 and 19, Ray, come on. And the sons of Noah that went forth of the ark was Shem, uh -huh. Ham, and Japheth. Uh -huh. And Ham is the father of Canaan. Ham is the father of Canaan. But continue, Ray. What verse was that? 19. That was 19. Let's go to Genesis, the 10th chapter. Let's read that 19 before read, we go. Read it again. These are the three sons of Noah. No, no, two sons of Noah. Three. The three sons of Noah. Go ahead, bro. And of them was the whole earth overspread. Of them was the whole earth overspread. Genesis chapter 10, Will. Genesis chapter 10, Ray. When you get it, pick it up at verse 1. We're going 1 through 5. When you get it, go ahead, my brother. Now these are the generations of the sons of Noah. Uh -huh. Shem, Shem, Ham, Ham, and Japheth. Go ahead. And unto them were sons born after the flood. After the flood. Come on, Ray. The sons of Japheth. Now, here are the... Now, pay attention. This right here with debunk. If you're not a Jew, you're a Gentile. Go ahead, Ray. These are the sons of Japheth. Go ahead. Goma and Magar, uh -huh. Maida, uh -huh. and Javan. Yes. And Tubal. Yes. Meshach. Yes. And Tyrus. And the sons of Goma, uh -huh. Askenaz. Wait a minute. Askenaz. I've heard of an Askenazi Jew. Mm. You can't be. Mm -mm. You cannot be an Askenazi Jew because their Jews come from Noah's son Shem, and Askenaz come from Noah's son Japheth, or the Gentiles. Go ahead, Ray. And Raphath and Tergamal, uh -huh. and the sons of Javan, uh -huh. Elisha, uh -huh. and Tarshish, uh -huh. Kittim, uh -huh. and Dodim. And Dodim, go ahead. By these were the house of the Gentiles. Oh, divided. you don't hear nothing about no Jews. Mm -mm. These are the sons of Japheth. These are what you call Gentiles or what you call enslaved white people or the modern name, Caucasians. That's right. Mm -hmm. You know who they are? Europeans and their descendants. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. European and their descendants. Chinese are Far East Europe, but they made a, a continent called Asia, but it's on the European continent. Just like India is on the European continent, sisters and brothers. These are Europe is the nations of the Gentiles. That's right. That's why Paul went to Greece. Paul went to Athens. Paul went to Thessalonica. Paul went to Corinth. He preached in Crete. He preached in Cyprus. These are the islands of the Gentiles. Italy. Paul dealt with Cornelius, an Italian centurion, a Roman centurion. The definition of centurion, a Roman soldier who is charged over 100 soldiers. Where we at, Ray? Still first. By these were the house of the Gentiles divided in their land. Yes. Every one after his tongue. Uh -huh. After their families. Yes. In their nation. In their what? Nation. nation. In their nations. Wait, give me verse 32. Go ahead. 32? Yes. He said. Uh-huh. Again. Are, he going to tell you again. The families. Go ahead. These are the families of the sons of Noah. Uh-huh. After their generations. Uh-huh. In their nations. Yes. And by these were the nations divided in the earth. Yes. After the flood. After the flood. Wait, give me chapter 11. Mm -hmm. Genesis 11. Give me verse 1 and then we'll skip quickly. And the whole earth was one language. Uh -huh. And of one speech. Wait a minute. So everybody spoke the same language. That's what your book Had said. the same tongue. Yes. That means Shem, had, that means the Japheth, the Gentile spoke a tongue. Everybody and all the, the sons of Noah. Tongue. The Hamites. Hamites are what you call African sisters and brothers mm -hmm. in their nations. That's the just Ham's children. Mm -hmm. That's right. Shem is Abraham come out of Shem, mm -hmm. sisters and brothers, which come out of Eber. Mm -hmm. Come on, Ray. And it came to pass as they journeyed from the east. Skip down to verse uh, six, six through nine, my brother. I'm sorry. Go and, ahead. And the Lord said, Behold, yes. the people is one. Yes. And they have all one language. Uh -huh. And this they began to do. Uh -huh. And now nothing will be restrained from them, uh -huh. which they have imagined to do. Because every imagination of man starts is wicked continually. Evil it's wicked and evil continually. And this was not in the plan of God. Let me show you why. Go ahead, Ray. Go to. Let us go down there and confound their language. Uh -huh. That they may not understand one another's speech. Come on, brother. So the Lord scattered them abroad from thence upon the face of all the earth. Uh -huh. And they left out to build the city. Uh, and they left out to build the city. Why? Because they couldn't understand each other's speech. Mm -hmm. If you can't understand what... Will is saying, and I can't understand what Ray is saying. What's the use of us communicating? That's right. We can't understand. So we're going to leave. Go ahead, Ray. Therefore is the name of it called Babel. Uh -huh. Because the Lord did there confound the language of all the earth. He confounded the language of all the earth. Of all the earth, Ray. Let's go to Deuteronomy, the fourth chapter. Deuteronomy, the fourth chapter. Because sisters and brothers, everybody think that, listen, all blacks are not Hamites. That's right. Let me give you a definition of ham. Mm -hmm. According to the Zondervan Bible Dictionary, Ham, the youngest son of Noah, born probably about 96 years before the flood, and one of the eight persons to live through the flood, he became the progenitor of the dark races, not the Negroes, not the Negroes. but the Egyptians, the, which was Mizraim, uh, the Ethiopians, which are Cushites, the Libyans, and the Canaanites. Remember, the land of Israel was called the land of Canaan before it was called the land of Israel. The, Jeshu, the Jebusites dwelt there in that time. Okay? Mm -hmm. So not the Negroes. These are your African nations or Hamitic nations. But all blacks are not Hamites. That's right. All blacks are not Hamites, sisters and brothers. Mm -hmm. Let's go to Deuteronomy 4, chapter 8, and pick it up at verse 1, and then we'll skip. Mm -hmm. Deuteronomy 4, verse 1, and then we'll skip. Go ahead, my brother. Now therefore hearken, O Israel, unto the statutes and to the judgments which I shall teach you. Listen, my Hebrew Israelite brothers, you come out of Abraham and you got knowledge of identity, but do you have the understanding? We're going to find out if your understanding agrees with what's written in this book. Don't bring me the Apocrypha. Don't bring me the lost books because no book can stand up to the Bible. The Bible will prove all books. Show me eternal life. Show me salvation in the Apocrypha. Show me salvation in the lost books. I got salvation here. That's right. From Genesis to Revelation. Come on, Ray. For to do them, uh -huh. that she may live and go in and possess the land which the Lord God of your fathers giveth you. Yes. Ye shall not add unto the word 
which I command you, uh -huh. neither shall you diminish out from it. So don't add to God's word and don't take away from God's word. He know what he's doing. He's the creator and maker of everything oh, and everybody. Yeah. He don't need your help or my help. All he asked you to do was obey by voice. That's all. That's it. That's all. Come on, Ray. That you may keep the commandments of the Lord your God, uh -huh. which I command you. Yes. Your eyes have seen what the Lord did because of Baal Peor. Uh -huh. For all the men that follow Baal Peor, the Lord thy God have destroyed them from among you. Ooh, so now you're going to accuse the Gentiles of how celebrate Christmas. You did your dirt. Mm. Yeah, you did. We reading it. Come on. Come on, Ray. <laughs> but ye did... But ye that did cleave unto the Lord your God are uh -huh. alive, every one of you this day. Every one of you this day. Is what, Ray? Behold, I have taught you statutes and judgment, uh -huh. even as the Lord my God commanded me, uh -huh. that ye should do so in the land, whether ye go to possess it. Uh -huh. Keep therefore and do them. Keep therefore and do them. Not march and protest. Keep therefore and do them. Come on, Ray. For this is your wisdom and your understanding in the sight of the nations, uh -huh. which, which shall hear all these statutes and say, surely this great nation is a wise and how, understanding How are you going to do it, Ray? They're going to hear it. That's right. Ray, right. tell me, where does faith come from? By hearing. Yeah. Hearing and, by the word of God. But That's how right. could they hear without what will? Without what I teach preacher. you. Like without a preacher. Mm -hmm. And when their preacher is sent from God, they will feed you with, not understand, with uh, wisdom and understanding. That's Got right. this brother out here talking about Brother Bowie shouldn't be teaching. He's too old. He uh, it's, the, it's the young lion's lion's turn. I dare you to challenge him. I dare you to challenge him, sisters and brothers. <laughs> oh, by the way, all the patriarchs died out of office. What book you reading? What book you read, Ray? Mm. What verse we at? Seven. Come on. For what nation is there so great who have mm. God so nigh to them uh -huh. as the Lord our God is in all things that we call upon him for? Israel. Ain't no nation great like Israel. Go ahead. And what nation is there so great that have statutes and judgments so righteous as all this law uh -huh. which I set before you this day? Man, Ray, skip down to verse 13 and mm -hmm. go ahead and read that. Mm -hmm. Yes. And he declared unto you his covenant. He declared it unto you, Israel. And we're going to show you that it was not Israel alone, just a mixed multitude among us. But the Lord called the whole nation Israel, mm -hmm. right? Which he commanded you to perform. Yes. Even ten commandments. No margin, no protesting, just ten commandments. Keep my ten commandments. You want to know what they are? Go to Exodus, the 20th chapter. They there. Yes, sir. The Lord tell you in the New Testament, good master, what must I do? Keep the commandments. That's right. Go ahead, Ray. And he wrote them upon two tables of stone. Yeah, he did. He wrote them on two tables of stone because what's written in stone is forever, sisters and brothers. Mm -hmm. Let's move on. Mm -hmm. Let's go to Matthew, the 28th chapter. Mm -hmm. Sister Savannah Hollis said, we also have Israelites that believe only in the Old Testament. Yeah, you got time to grow up. Graduation night, time to grow up, mm -hmm. time to keep reading. Lord say, oh, by the way, the if you go in the Old Testament, we could teach Jesus to you out of the Old Testament from Genesis mm -hmm. to Malachi. Right. Oh, by the way, in the Old Testament, it tells you that from the rising of the sun, my name shall be great among That's the right. Gentiles, mm -hmm. among the Gentiles, among the Gentiles. But we profane his holy name. Yes, and we're going to read that to you. People say, well, Brother Julius, you got an attitude. I'm going to keep it. <laughs> I'm going to keep it, sisters and brothers, because I am sick and tired of this folly. And you wonder why we in captivity. Yep. Mm. Because we refuse to heed the words of the Lord God of Israel. Right. Oh, yeah, it's a family show. It's a, but it's time for truth tonight. We're going to get dirty. We're going to take the gloves off. <laughs> We're going to take the gloves off. Matthew 28, give me 18 to 20, Ray. Matthew 28, 18 to 20. And you can read the same thing in Mark the 16th chapter. Look what Jesus said. This is the Lord himself. The one that you call Yahweh, the one that you call Yahweh, Yeshua. This is the Lord Himself speaking. We call Him Jesus. The the, the Gentile recognized that name worldwide. Ray. And Jesus came and spake unto them, saying, "Yeah, all power is given unto me in heaven and in earth, and uh, everywhere, because He's the Creator, and Maker of everything." Ray. That's right. Go ahead. Go ye therefore and teach all nations baptizing them. Oh no, 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 no! You made an error. Go ye therefore and do what? Teach all nations. No, just teach Israel. Mm -hmm. Oh. Just teach Israel. Ray. Teach all nations. Uh-huh. Baptizing them in the name of the Father. Uh-huh. And of the Son. Yes. And of the Holy Ghost. Yes. 
teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. Wait a minute. If you are chosen, Israel is chosen. Mm -hmm. That's why we read uh, Deuteronomy 4 chapter. The Lord chose Israel to be a peculiar people, mm -hmm. a special people, his priests to the rest of the sons of the nation. So when you ask what my job is, <laughs> my job is to teach everybody who wants to have salvation. Why are you mad at me? Come on, here come Brother Julius, the savior of the Gentiles. Jesus is the savior of the Gentiles. I'm just a priest. One of a nation of priests. A whole nation. Male and female priests, sisters and brothers. What book you reading, brothers? What book are you reading? Tell me we shouldn't be teaching the Gentiles. Why not? We was taught. Mm -hmm. Come right. on, Ray. And lo, I am with you always. Uh-huh. Even until the end of the world. Let's go to Romans the 8th chapter. And let's look at the chosen apostle to the Gentiles. Yeah, Peter taught him first. He was the chief. But the Lord chose Paul. The one that used to be called Saul. Or what you call Saul. The Lord called you change your name or what you become. Whatever you are. The books of his ways is righteous, right? That's right. All his ways. All his ways is righteous. Right. Give me Romans the 8th chapter, my brother. Uh -huh. Romans 8 and 1. Go ahead and we'll skip. There is therefore now no condemnation to them which are in Christ Jesus. To, to, uh, to Israel. To them that are in Christ to Jesus. To them which are in, in, in Christ Jesus. Go ahead, my brother. Who, who walk not after the flesh, uh -huh. but after the spirit. You got to walk after the spirit, not the flesh. That's right. Because if you walk out the flesh, the book don't tell you, you die. will die. I told you, it is graduation night. It's time to stop thinking man and start believing and thinking God. You got to grow that mind, sisters and brothers. A mind is a terrible thing to waste. Terrible. Mm -hmm. Verse 5. Skip down to verse 5 and go ahead, my brother. But they that are after the flesh do mind the things of the flesh. Yes. But they that are after the spirit, the things of the spirit. The things of the spirit. Come on, Ray. For to be carnal man, it is death. But to be spiritual man, it is life and peace. That's why people go through drama and they can't handle the drama because the carnal mind reigns. You got to let the Lord give you that spirit mind, a new mind what I put within you. I ain't got nothing to do with no fringes. He going to put the word in your mind, sisters and brothers. He going to put the words in your, the heart is a blood pump. So as a man thinketh, so, so is he. So is he. That's right. So is he. That was verse six. That was verse yeah, six. Give me 13 and 14, Ray. Mm -hmm. 13 and 14. Look at, he, look at the teacher of the Gentiles. He's teaching Rome. The church at Rome. Rome is in Italy. That's right. That's, right. That's the Gentile nation. Go ahead. For if we live after the flesh, uh -huh. ye shall die. You shall die. But if ye through the spirit do mortify the deeds of the body, ye shall live. Adam and Eve didn't believe God. They lead to their own understanding and lean not to the flesh. That's why you have funerals. Mm -hmm. It's not supposed to be. Mm -hmm. It's not supposed to be, Will. Not at all, brother. What verse way? 14. Come on. For as many as are led by the Spirit of God. No, brother. Only if only Israel is led by the Spirit of God. For as many as are led by the Spirit of God, uh -huh. they are the sons of God. They are the what? The sons, sons of God. Wait, give me 17. And go ahead. Mm -hmm. Give me 17. And if children and heirs and heirs of God and joint heirs with Christ. Wait a minute. Read 16. I don't want to miss this. Go ahead. The Spirit itself bear witness with our spirit uh -huh. that we are the children of God. If, listen, listen, listen. Jesus told the Jews, I know that you Abraham seed, mm -hmm. but you seek to kill me. Abraham mm -hmm. didn't seek to do that. Mm -hmm. You of your father, the devil. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you are contrary to what's written in this book, you have the spirit of Antichrist. I don't care what nation you come from. Mm -hmm. Everybody got a line up. Why do you think Christ had to come? Mm -hmm. Because Adam killed us. We abdic Adam abdicated the right to eternal salvation. Jesus came and restored it. Not just to Israel. But to all nations. But he had to come and kickstart his priest. That's right. But his priest blew the mission. Yes. Wait, but that's the end of that. Still blowing the mission. And still, look, come on, brother, 17. Mm -hmm. And if children. And if children. Then heirs then of heirs. God. Uh -huh. And join heirs with Christ. Yes. If so be that we suffer with Wait. him, that we may also glorify together. Mm -hmm. So that means it's going to be salvation for whoever wants it. Whosoever will. Let, let him come. come. Let him right. come. This is what the books say. Mm -hmm. This is what the books say. Will, let's go to Romans the second chapter. Back up to Romans the second chapter. Mm -hmm. Boy, all this book here, and I'm saying, I'm listening to my brothers, and I love my brothers. Julius, brother, the sister has a question. She said, what is a carnal mind? Carnal mind the is the mind. flesh and blood mind that you're born with. That's right. It wants everything in the flesh. 
that's contrary to, that's the, contrary Lord. to the Lord. It wants whatever pleases the flesh. And John told you in 1 John, the second chapter, all that's in the world is what? Lust the lust, lust of the, of the eyes, eyes, the pride, pride of life, the lust of the flesh. flesh that's the right. lust of the flesh is of the world. That's it. That is carnal. Cannot inherit the that's why God. the Lord that's said, right. don't be conformed to, to this world. But be you transformed, transformed by the renewing of, of your, your mind. Your mind. This whole, listen, listen. This is the bomb of Gilead. Yeah. This is the word of God. Brother Will, Brother Ray, Brother Julius, we're just ministers of the word. Mm -hmm. Odot, we're ministers of the word. Yes, that's right. The word belongs to God. We didn't write it, that's and right. you didn't write it. That's, that's right. right. I got to obey it. The Gentile got to obey it. Yes. Listen, sisters and brothers. Listen, I'm going to take off my glasses. Listen, listen. Oh, I didn't put them on. <laughs> listen. Listen, listen, yeah, I'm listen. A, a closer personal with them. Listen, listen, you. listen. I wish I could get closer. Listen. <laughs> the Lord told Adam, the day you eat of the doctrine of the devil or eat of the tree of the knowledge of good and evil, you shall surely die. The last time I went to the funeral, the Gentile going to the funeral, they put him in the ground. Mm -hmm. The Gentile has to use the washroom. He has to eat. He has to live. He has to sleep just like the Israelite, just like the Hamite. He got lived by every word. Of the and when he, died, died, they, when he died, Will, they put him in a nice little box, right. suit, dress, take him to the cemetery and put him back in the ground. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because God is no respect to a person. He ain't like you. Woo. He's not like you. Don't put him in a box. You can't limit God. You hurt yourself. Where am I at, Ray? Romans 2. Come on, Romans 2 and pick it up at verse 1. Therefore, thou art inexcusable, old man, uh -huh. whosoever thou art that judges. Whosoever thou art that judges. He said man. Mm -hmm. He didn't say Israel. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Paul is talking to the Gentiles. Go ahead. For wherein thou judges another, uh -huh. thou condemnest thyself. Be careful. That's why you got to be careful who you judge. Be careful what you type on social media. It might come back on you. Mm -hmm. Every idle word is going to be accounted for. Everything that's typed is going to be accounted for. You can't hide from God. Come on, Ray. But thou that judges do us the same thing. Listen carefully. Listen carefully. Because he's telling you what you did. Thou that judges, what did he say, Ray? But we are sure that the judgment of God is according to the truth yes. against them that commit such things. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And Continue. Think, and think as thou this old man uh -huh. that judges them which, which do such things and do us the same. That's called hypocrisy. Go ahead. That thou shalt escape the judgment of God. Absolutely not. Go ahead. Or despises thou the riches of his goodness and forbearance and long suffering, uh -huh. not knowing that the goodness of God leadeth thee to repentance? Because Woo. that's why you, he's long suffering with us. That's we don't right. deserve to be alive. Long, we should bro. be dead long ago. Mm, we right. born in sin, sisters and brothers. Mm. That's why he had mercy on the woman they called her adultery. He said, Go and sin no mm. more. That's right. That means don't continue in it. I guarantee you. I guarantee you, when you find out you're about to be stoned, I guarantee you, you'll change your attitude. Yes, sir. That woman was converted, sisters and brothers. Mm -hmm. The Lord said if he mark iniquity, who shall stand? Ooh. Ooh. Man. Mm -mm. Come on, Ray. Verse 5. Come on. But after that, thy heart is imprinted in heart, treasures up to thyself wrath against the day of wrath, uh -huh. and the revelation of the righteous judgment of God. That's what you're doing. You're perverting the righteous judgment of God, sisters and brothers, by that type of behavior. Give me verse 9 through 11, Ray. Mm -hmm. And if we move in swiftly, sisters and brothers, go back on your own leisure and I read it, and I promise you, I, I promise you, you're going to get something out of this every time. Yes, that's yes. right. Brother Julius is not doing this uh, big, uh, for show. Brother Julius is doing it because I love the Lord my God, and I'm trying to do my job as a watchman and warn the people from him. Mm -hmm. But if you want to be on the negative end of prophecy, have at it. Be like Burger King. Have it your way. Ray, come on. Tribulation and anguish uh -huh. upon every soul of man that doeth evil. Mm. What of, every who? Every, every soul, soul of man that doeth evil. Oh, the only Israel. Every soul of man that doeth evil. Go ahead, brother. Of the Jew first. Of the who first? Ooh. Of the Jew first. Ooh, why? Because you were the one the Lord gave the, the right to, and the oracles and the answers to, sisters and brothers. That's right. Read, Ray. And also of the Gentiles. Ooh, so the Gentiles get the same punishment as we do when they get out of pocket. That's, That's right. right. Because God has no respect to a person's. Mm -hmm. Which he's a righteous judge. What That's book right. are you reading, brothers? Hey. I exhort to you, repent. Mm -hmm. Stop kicking. It's hard to kiss against the pricks. You're going to break your feet and your leg and your hip and your ribs and your... Oh, man. You're going to break you to pieces like potter's clay. Mm -hmm. 
Great. Like he did Dagon. For glory and honor and peace unto every man that worketh good to the Jew first to the and Jew also first? to the Gentile. Did you read what I heard you read? The, to the Jew first uh -huh. and also to the, to the Gentile. Gentile. Why, Ray? For there is no respect of persons with God. What Ooh. book you read? You ain't going to find this in the Apocrypha. You're not going to find it in the lost books. That's right. Only out of the book of the law of the Lord. Sisters and brothers, you, if you're enjoying this lesson, mm. throw us some hearts up there. Sure. If yeah, you're sure. learning something, mm. sisters and brothers. Ray, give me 13 and 14. It ain't over. It ain't over. Ray, 13 and 14. For not the hearers of the law are just before God, uh -huh. but the doers of the law shall be justified. So if the Gentile is keeping the commandments, keeping the Passover, keeping the feast of the Lord, why should he not have salvation? Right. That's, That's right. right. Who are you to judge? The Lord said he's the righteous judge. Mm -hmm. Ray. But when the Gentiles, which have not the law, uh -huh. do by nature the things contained in the law, uh -huh. these having not the law uh -huh. are law unto themselves. Because Amen. they don't have no understanding. Amen. So they are law unto themselves. So they, why well, you think the Gentiles run the world and pass a law that's breaking God's law? Because they don't have the understanding. Because we didn't teach them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We didn't teach them, Ray. That's right. Because if they knew better, they would do, do better. But guess what? I'm not mad. I have no enemy. Satan is my enemy. The only way if you become my enemy is if you become antichrist. That's it. Mm -hmm. Because my Bible, the book that I read, he said, love your enemies. Right. Wait. Give me verse 17. 17. Yes, sir. Behold, thou art called listen, a Jew. Listen. Listen, my Hebrew brothers. Everybody want to be a Jew. You forget mm -hmm. about the other nine, uh, the other uh, 11, uh, 11 tribes. That's right. Mm -hmm. Behold, thou art called a Jew, uh -huh. and restest in the law. Yeah, you and, lean on the law. You lean on the Torah. And makest thou boast of God, uh -huh. and knowest his will. Yes. And approvest the things that are more excellent. Because he done showed it to you. Come on, Ray. Being instructed out of the law. Because he would taught you out of the law. Go ahead, the Ten Commandments. Go ahead. And I confident that thou thyself art God of the blind. That's what and, you say you are. And a light of them which are in darkness. Go ahead, Ray. And instruct of the foolish. Because that's what we told you to do. That's the right. word of God, to teach the word of God. This and our knowledge of his word and his laws and his statutes. This is our understanding among the nations. Not marching in protest where Brother Judas, you're going to march with us against the white man. Heck to the no. No, no, no. Hell no. I ain't <laughs> going right. with y'all. Right. Right. You know why? Because you better read Deuteronomy. The Lord told Israel, hey. They want to fight against the Amorites. The Lord said, don't go up. I'm not, not among you. you. That's right. Mass That's numbers right. of people mm -hmm. don't mean that things are right. Man. Teach Ray, brother. Come Teach. on, Ray. Come on, Ray. An instructor of the foolish. Yes. A teacher of babes. Yes. Which have a form of knowledge uh -huh. and of the truth in the law. Because you've been instructed, Ray. Go ahead. Thou therefore which teaches another. Yes. Teaches thou not thyself. Oh, so in teaching, you want to correct somebody else, but you ain't straight. Jesus said it this way. Before you judge somebody else, take the beam out of your eye. True. Ray, thou that preaches a man should not steal. Yes, does thou steal? You tell you tell people don't steal, but you a thief yourself. That's hypocrisy. Read, Ray. Thou that says a man should not commit adultery. Uh huh. Does thou commit adultery? Do you are you an adulterer? Go ahead. Thou that abhors idols. Uh huh. Does thou commit sacrilege? Look what the Lord is asking. Go ahead. Go ahead, Ray. Thou that makest thou boast of the law uh -huh. to break in the law, Ooh. dishonoreth thou God? Think man. about it. Man. Think about it. You boasted in the law. Well, the Lord said this, and I'm the priest, and I'm the Israelite. You got to bow down and kiss my feet. Read that to me. Mm, 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 the yeah. Lord said, go and teach all nations, not make them subject to you. That's that ain't right. your job. Jesus right. came. He was humble, Julius. He came smooth. He said he would not even bruise or read, right? That's right. That's right. Smoking flesh till he's not quick. He didn't, convict, he not quick. He didn't convict nobody. He not even want to call it an adultery. He just told her to go and sin no more. Man. Man. Put the Jews to shame. That's they right. We caught this woman in a very active adultery. Why you catch the woman? Why you didn't bring the man? <laughs> That's right. That's what he asked. You error greatly. Man. So Teach, he gave brother. her a pass. Teach. We read. For the name of God is blasphemed among the Gentiles through you. Through you, as Israel. It is written. Tell my son, oh, uh, you teach, you messed up the name of the Lord. The world is messed up because of you, and I claim that responsibility. Daniel said, we and our fathers have sinned. Why you want to acknowledge your transgressions? That's right. Man. Wait, read that again. For the, the name of God is blasphemed among the Gentiles through you. Through you. As it is written. Through you, Israel. Mm-hmm. 
We got to do better. We can do better. We will do better. But it takes knowledge. You can't run around and walk around with hate. Mm -mm. And talking about hate speech, you can't do that. Even man got a law against that now. Mm -hmm. You can't do it, sisters and brothers. That's what's got Satan, an accuser, got him kicked out, his pride. Mm -hmm. So what you is will? Going to be a lot of Israel like, I don't want to go to the fire. Mm, man. I don't know. Everything that's in the lake of fire is anti-Christ. That's right. Mm. Did we finish that way? Come on, 24. We're 25. We're 25. 25. 25. Come on, bro. For the circumcision verily proper if, if thou keep the law. I'm a Jew and I'm circumcised. That's good if you keep the law. But what if you... Go ahead, Ray. But if thou be a breaker of the law, uh -huh. thy circumcision is made uncircumcised. I don't care if you get your skin cut 19 times. You ain't keeping the law. What good is it? It's an act of vanity. You got to circumcise that mind. That's, right. That's the biggest circumcision, along right. with that flesh. That's right. Women, you got to circumcise your mind. That's that heart. That's right. Look at the heart. Mm -hmm. Sisters and brothers, it's that mind. Mm -hmm. You got to do this, sisters and brothers. You got to do it. 28 and 29, Ray. But he is not a Jew, which is one outwardly. Pay attention. Pay attention. Read. Neither is that circumcision, which is outwardly in the flesh. Uh-huh. But he is a Jew, which is one inwardly. Which is one. That's the mind, sisters and brothers. The mind. Come on, Ray. And circumcision is that of the heart in yes. the spirit yes. and not in the letter whose praise is not of men but of God. God. Understand what Paul is telling you, sisters and brothers. That's right. Please understand this. So what you in Israelite. But if you ain't got no knowledge and understanding, what good is it? Mm -hmm. How you going to hold this back from the rest of the world? And the Lord is, God, Jesus himself told you to go and teach our nation. We taught the world how to baptize. We taught them how to keep the feast, the Passover. Let's go uh, to, uh, where we at? First, First Corinthians, the 10th chapter. Mm -hmm. Sisters and brothers, if you have just joined us, we are talking about the conversion of the Gentiles. Uh -huh. We are mm -hmm. getting this lesson brought to you today by Brother Julius. Man. And reader today is Brother uh, Ray Ben, and I am mm -hmm. Brother Will, your host. And Praise we thank God. you for joining us. Go Man. ahead, Brother Julius, back over to you. Man. First Corinthians 10. 10 and 1. When you get it, Ray, let's go. Move, brethren. I would not have you should be ignorant. Go ahead, Ray. How that all our fathers were under the cloud uh -huh. and all passed through the sea uh -huh. and were all baptized in the Moses in the cloud and in the sea. That was a pre, a pre, uh, what they call precursor. it? A precursor to mm -hmm. water baptism. That's right. Because that was a spiritual baptism. All Israel were baptized and the mixed multitude with them. That's right. Baptized together. Come on, Ray. And did all eat the same spiritual meat. Uh -huh. And did all drink the same spiritual drink. Go ahead, Ray. For they drank of that spiritual rock that followed them. Who was he? And that rock was Christ. And that Man. rock was Christ. That's Go ahead, Ray. But with many of them, God was not well pleased. Uh -huh. For they were overthrown in the wilderness. Uh -huh. Now these things were our examples. Uh -huh. To the intent we should not lust after evil things. Don't they do also it. Lusted. Don't do it. Neither be ye idolaters as was some of them. As it is written, the people sat down to eat and drink and rose up to play. Brother told me, Brother Julian, we getting that. The, the Gentiles going to give us reparations. Nah, -uh, it ain't going to happen. You got reparations. No, no, we ain't never got. Yeah, you did. You got your reparations. You took it and you spoiled Egypt and you built you a golden cow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You don't know how to handle reparations. That's right. I'm going to let the Lord give me my reward at his coming. Yes, What's sir. that reparation? That long white robe. And to him, him say, well done, my good and faithful servant. Ray, Ray, go. Neither let us commit fornication, uh -huh. as some of them committed and fell in one day, three and twenty thousand. Oh, but you don't want to acknowledge your transgression. You want to point out everybody else's sin? And you want to be on the corner with your microphones and your megaphones? Uh-uh, sisters and brothers. Acknowledge your transgressions. Then straighten out people. Go ahead, Ray. Neither let us tempt Christ as some of them are also tempted uh -huh. and were destroyed of serpents. Uh -huh. Neither murmur ye as some of them are also murmured and were destroyed of the destroyer. Like the Lord don't understand that you, you're mumbling. Come on, Lord. The Lord, Come on, y'all. The Lord speak fish. He speak flies. He speak frog. Mm -hmm. He speak lice. Right. Come on, Ray. Now all these things happen to them, for example, uh -huh. and... They are written for our admonition. They are written for our admonition. The last days, sisters and brothers. Go ahead, Ray. Upon whom the ends of the world are come. Yes, go ahead, Ray. Wherefore, let him that thinketh he standeth take heed, lest, lest he, he fall. fall. You That's think right. you high You think you all let? That's right. <laughs> the Lord going to say, man, come on. You just a, 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 a drop in the bucket. Just mm -hmm. need the feet of the Lord. That's what you are, sisters and brothers, when you get high-minded and want to exclude everybody else. Mm -hmm. Ray, give me verse 20 and 21, and then we'll move on. Okay. Look what he say. Look what Paul is saying to the church at Corinth. Go ahead. But I say, 
that the things with the Gentiles sacrifice. Yes. They sacrifice the devil. What? They sacrifice the devil. Yes. And not to God. Yes. And I would not that you should have fellowship with them. Ooh. Why, Ray? You cannot drink the cup of the Lord and the cup of devil. Didn't Adam and Eve talk to Satan? Yes, sir. And what and what was their punishment? They got kicked out and brought here in death. That's right. You can't serve God and your flesh. But Julius. Because this is worldly stuff. That's Satan domain. I hear you, Julius. But come on. A, a scripture always come to mind, Julius, because yes. we we going into this holiday that's coming up yes. called Christmas, which was originally was a Gentile holiday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the Lord told Israel back in, in the wilderness, He said, "You talk the wicked ones, they ways." Yes. Right. You talk the wicked. Well, we finna read that. They ways. Mm -hmm. Not only that, will not only that, not just Christmas, Halloween, yeah, Easter, all those holidays, all that stuff. That's right. That our father knew not of. But they came out, Julius. They 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 showed us them holidays and things. But we taught, we showed them how to do it even better, man, mm -hmm. even greater. Look, look it. When you drive to the Israelite neighborhood, see who got all the lights. Yes. When you when you see who talking about Christmas on Facebook and stuff, the Israel are the main ones glorifying this thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Above and beyond, sisters and brothers. Yes. We 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 go all out, like the people say. We go all out. The Lord said, Father. Ray, the Lord said, <laughs> wow. the, the Lord said, we sold each other for a pair of shoes. Pair of shoes. And now we done graduated to human trafficking. Man. Mm -hmm. To Man. human trafficking. Mm -hmm. Shame on us. Man. Shame on us. Ray. 21, Julius. Come on. You cannot drink the cup of the Lord. You cannot drink the cup of the Lord. And the cup of devil. Yes. That's right. You cannot be partaker of the Lord's table and of the table of devil. You cannot do this, Israel. Do we provoke the Lord to jealousy? Uh -huh. Are we strong in here? Absolutely not. Emphatically, mm -hmm. absolutely not. Mm -hmm. Listen, sisters and brothers, the Gentiles sacrificed on the devil because we didn't teach them. That's right. But let me show you the first devils. Let's go to Deuteronomy, the 32nd chapter. Let's mm -hmm. back up. Mm -hmm. Hey. You hitting, you hitting it home today, brother. I'm Julius. sick and tired of this, Will. I'm sick and tired of this folly. The Lord is trying to clean this and to sanitize Israel, his people, so they can do their job. Like my grandma used to and say. And if you don't change, you're going to be consumed just like the Lord said. That's right. Grandma used to say, teach the truth and shame the devil. <laughs> That's right. Because <laughs> the devil is a lie. That's right. <laughs> oh, by the way, in the game, Satan can't win playing God's game. Not at all. Mm -hmm. It ain't no game. It ain't no game, brother. Deuteronomy 32, give me verse 8. Right. Let's look at some folly that we did. Oh, we messed up bad on. Mm -hmm. Oh, we messed up bad. Real bad. Come on, brother. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When the Most High divided to the nations there in heritage. Oh, mm -hmm. the, the, them the, the nations of Shem, Ham, and Japheth. When he separated the sons of Adam. Yes. He set the bounds of the people according to the number of the children of Israel. Listen, sisters and brothers, the whole world is in turmoil because of us. The Lord, you reading it right here. When the Most High divided to the nations their inheritance, when he separated the sons of Adam. He set the bounds of the people because Noah is still and his descendants is still. We all still the sons of Adam. Mm -hmm. He did it according to the number of the children of Israel because he loved Israel. Mm -hmm. We are his children. And he that touches us touches the apple of the father's eye. Mm -hmm. And whatever the Gentiles have done in overdoing what they what the Lord did, uh, allowed them to do to us, the Lord said, vengeance is mine. I will repay. It ain't your, your job to take vengeance. You don't know how. That's why I get yourself killed. That's right. But then what do we do, Ray? What do we do? Skip down to verse 15 and go ahead. But just one. Still Israel. But just one wax fat and yes. kick. Yes. Mm. Thou art waxing fat. Thou art grown thick. Yes. Thou art covered with fatness. Yes. Then he forsook God, which Ooh. made him mm. and lightly esteemed the rock of his The salvation. Lord told you way back. Mm. He told you, don't forget me. Deuteronomy 4, chapter. Don't forget me. If you forget me, you're going to worship all, everything in the creation and in the universe. Mm. Well, my zodiac sign, I'm a Leo, I'm a Capricorn. So what does that got to do with anything? That ain't got nothing to do with salvation. Not That's all. vanity. All is vanity. It's preaching. That ain't nothing but vanity, sisters That's and right. brothers. You're actually dealing with fallen angels. In truth. Research it. I dare you. Research it. Ray. 16. Go ahead. They provoked him to jealousy with strange God. Uh huh. With abomination provoked they him to anger. Uh huh. They sacrificed unto devils, not to God. Wait, 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 wait. But the Gentile, but you accused the Gentile of sacrificing the devil, but you did it first. That's right. You did it first. And still, 
and still doing it. Mm -hmm. Our Father didn't know nothing about the God of Christmas. Read to me anywhere from Genesis to the Revelation where Jesus Christ was born December 25th. Read to me where he died on Good Friday and rose Sunday morning. And I will read to you that when Jesus was born, he was born in a manger and the why the shepherds found in him. Mm -hmm. When the wise men found in him, he was in a house at two years old. You can't even get that right. Mm -hmm. The whole nativity scene is wrong. Mm -hmm. Daniel, the Lord told you in Daniel the ninth chapter that Messiah shall be killed in the middle of the week. It's seven days in the week. So it's three side, three days on this side of the of the, the middle day, and it's three days on that side. He told you, Messiah, when did Friday become the middle of the week? Did when did uh, Sunday become the Sabbath day? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My people are destroyed for what? Like an knowledge. The book says, seek you out of the book of the Lord. The only God in the universe, in the creation that has his own instruction manual, mm -hmm. written by him, written, orchestrated, directed, and performed by him. Wait. What verse? 17. Read, brother. They sacrificing the devils not to God. So you did it first. Gentiles didn't know nothing about this till you taught them. They just came up with new stuff. Mm -hmm. But it came from you. Read, Ray. The gods whom they knew not. Mm -hmm. The new gods that came newly up. Whom your fathers feared not. And what did we do, Ray? Of a rock that begot thee, thou uh -huh. art unmindful. That you and are unmindful. And forgotten God that formed thee. Man, 21, Ray. 21, quick. And they have moved me to jealousy with that which is not God. Uh -huh. They have provoked me to anger with their vanity. Yes. And I will move them to jealousy with those that are not a people. Didn't even name a people. We jealous and we mad at everybody. You're mad at the Mexicans. You're mad at the Arabs. You're mad at everybody. You're mad at everybody. You're jealous of everybody. Oh, I got me. A, I moved into a new house. Somebody lived there before you did. Mm. You move into a neighborhood, people move out. Property value drops, trash on the corners, fill up the jail cells. What glory is that? Mm -mm -mm. What kind of glory is that? Come on, Ray. I will provoke them to anger with a foolish nation. Uh -huh. For fires kindled in mine anger, which shall burn into the Lord's head. The Lord is upset with us. That's why everything happened to us. Sisters and brothers, people always tell me, Brother Julius, it's something about our people. I can't put my finger on it. You're putting your, now you're putting your eyes and your finger and your ears on it. Come on, Rick. And shall consume the earth with her increase uh -huh. and set on fire the foundation of the mountain. So the Lord told you, at, uh, skip down to verse 24 and read it. No, no, 23. I will heap mischief upon oh, them. Oh, so it ain't the Gentiles. It's the Lord working through the Gentiles. Mm -hmm. It was the Lord working through the Babylonians. The Lord working through the Medo-Persians. The Lord working through the Greeks. The Lord working through the Roman Empire and soon to be the EU mm -hmm. when they come to full power. Mm -hmm. I will send my arrows upon them. Yes. And they shall be burnt with hunger. Yes. And devoured with burning heat yes. and with bitter destruction. Uh -huh. I will also send the teeth of beasts upon you them. You mad at the Gentiles? the Lord you need to got a problem with. Go ahead. With the pauses of servants of the dust. Uh huh. The watch this way. Watch this way. Watch this. Watch the this. Sword hey, oh, without. oh, 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 oh. Watch this, oh. Watch this. Go ahead. The sword without. The sword without. That's all the other nations. Go ahead. And tear within. That's your own people. Ain't nobody coming in your neighborhood killing you. Your own people is killing you. Gentile mess with you when you overstep your boundaries. Sometimes you ain't got to argue with the police. Just cooperate. You might get a chance to go home. Ray. Sure. Destroy both the young man and the bird and the, the suckling also with the man of gray hair. That's why the bullet, the stray bullet hits the baby. The stray bullet hits the grandma. The stray bullet hits the, the, the old man. The, the cup of the Lord is pouring out, Ray. Yes, it is. The That's Lord right. said, I'm going to do you. That's and then right. what he said, I'm going to do. I said I would scatter them in the corner. Uh-huh. I would make the remembrance them to cease from among me. Don't nobody remember you, so you got to try to come up. I, I'm going to go back into my ancestry. Read the book. Read the book of the Lord. I will. Mm -mm -mm. Read the book of the Lord. Exodus, the 12th chapter. Mm -mm -mm. Exodus, the 12th chapter, Ray. It's I told you we're going to extend it, though. We got to extend it because I, I really don't want to cut this. I Perf don't. Perfectly executed for the Lord, Julius. No nation can do this to us. It's too perfect. Think about it. You know your area and your, your city, wherever city you at, you know your neighborhood. That's a shame. Bars, gates, liquor stores, and churches. And on the corner, sagging. 
Mm. Well, Judas, you really hard on our people. The Lord wrote it. How he going to come back and get us? He going to do it better than our father. But until then, I don't care how tired you are of this oppression, you're going to serve every second of it. Mm -hmm. Ray. 37, verse Exodus 12 and verse 37. 37 and 38. Come on, brother. And the children of Israel journeyed from Ramses to Sukkot, uh -huh. about 600,000 on foot that were men besides children. Go ahead, Ray. And a mixed multitude went up also that means with that them. That was all Israel, a mixed multitude. Come on, Ray. And flocked and herds every, even very much cattle. Even very much cattle. Give me 43 and 44, Ray. 43 and 44. And the Lord said to Moses and Aaron, uh -huh. this is the ordinance of the past. So uh -huh. There shall no stranger eat thereof. Because he don't understand it. But when can he eat it, Ray? When Still, every man serving that is brought for money. Brought for money? When thou hast circumcised him, uh -huh. then shall he eat thereof. Then, because now he's learning how to serve the Lord. You cannot eat the Passover and be uncircumcised. That's right. That is a law. That's right. That's a statute, sisters and brothers. Mm -hmm. Even eat them do that. That's right. You can't do that. Come on, Ray. Skip uh, down, skip down to 48 and go ahead. Mm -hmm. And when the stranger shall sojourn with thee. A stranger, that's a non-Israelite. Go ahead. And will keep the pass over to the Lord. Uh-huh. Because he understand it now. Yes. Because you taught him properly. Go ahead, Ray. Let all his nails be circumcised. Uh-huh. And then let him come near and keep it. Why, Ray? And he shall be as one that is born in the land. Uh-huh. For no uncircumcised person shall eat thereof. Oh, uh, why? Why, Ray? One law shall be to him that is home born. That's the Israelite. And to the stranger that sojourneth among you. One law. That's right. The Gentiles offend God. The Lord will pass judgment on him. Israel do it. The Lord will pass judgment on him. The Hamite do it. The Lord will pass judgment on him. First Corinthians, the sixth chapter. First, a few more, and we out of here. First Corinthians, the sixth chapter. Y'all with me, sisters and brothers? Uh, you, it you, gets bro. better. It gets better. First Corinthians, the sixth chapter. Brothers gonna come to me talking about some. Why are you talking to them? You're not supposed to be sharing the word of God with them. That's ours. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. It's yours to teach. The Lord's. It's right. the Lord's. That's right. First Corinthians 6, give me 19 to 20, Ray. Mm -hmm. First Corinthians 6, 19 to 20. When you get it, go ahead, my brother. What? Know ye not your body is the temple of the Holy Ghost? Because the book said, well, you are purchased. Come on, Ray. Which is in you, which ye have of God, and uh -huh. ye are not your own. You ain't not your own. For ye are brought with the price. That is the precious blood of Jesus. When Jesus was crucified, his blood covered everybody. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everybody. And he said if he be lifted up Come on, earth, Ray. that he'll draw all men. No, no, some men. All, all men. All men unto him. Thank you for that, brother. Praise the Lord. Thank God you for God. that. For ye are brought with a price. You are bought with a price, Ray. Therefore glorify God in your body. Yes. And in your spirit. Yes. Which are God. Which are God. Back up to read verse 17 for me, brother. Yes. 17. And go ahead. But he that is drawn unto the Lord right. is one spirit. One spirit. Free fornication. Every sin that a man doeth is without the body, but he that committed fornication sinneth against his own body. Because you're walking in the flesh. And if you walk in the flesh, you should die. The wages of sin is death, death sisters right. and brothers. Yeah, right. So yeah, when the true. Gentile walk against God, he got death coming. When Israel walk against God, he got death coming. When the Hamite walk against God, he got death coming. Gentiles are European. The whole continent of Europe. Africa is called the land of Ham, sisters and brothers. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. I said, what book am my brothers reading? Mm -hmm. St. John, the third chapter. Mm -hmm. St. John, the third chapter. Sisters and brothers, thank you for tuning in. We are still, we still here, sisters and brothers. Don't leave us yet. It's greater to come. Overtime. The conversion of the Gentiles. Overtime, St. John 3 and 14. That's right. Let's, Let's take it back to the days of Moses, though. Mm -hmm. Hey, Sean, watch this one, Sean. Go ahead. And as Moses lifted up the servant uh -huh. in the wilderness, uh -huh. even so must the son of man be lifted up. What? The Wait a minute. Wait a minute. As Moses lifted up the serpent in the wilderness because Israel sinned his God, mm -hmm. the Lord sent some serpents in and killed some of them. They pleaded to Moses. Mm -hmm. The Lord said, get your serpent, wrap it around the stick and your uh, staff, and whoever look upon it shall live. Shall live. It's yeah. always been about faith. Mm -hmm. Whoever didn't look upon it, died. Great, great. That whosoever believes in him should not perish, uh -huh. but have eternal life. So now, them people believe and repent it. Yep. But now, what about our day and time? Come on, Ray. 
For God so loved the world uh -huh. that he gave his only begotten son, uh -huh. that whosoever believe in him. No, 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 only, only Israel. And Israel. whosoever believe in him uh -huh. should not perish, uh -huh. but have everlasting life. Come on, Ray, come on. For God sent not the son into the world to condemn the world, uh -huh. but that the world through him might be saved. The whole world might be saved. The Lord said he had no pleasure in the death of the wicked, but that all repent and turn. That's right. So therefore cast away from you all your transgressions and live ye. That's right. So iniquity Why will you die? Be your ruin. So that iniquity or sin will not be your ruin. Raise 36 and we'll move on. Mm -hmm. 36, my brother. Mm -hmm. He that believe on the Son have everlasting life. The, the, no denomination here. Mm -hmm. No respect of persons. Mm -hmm. Start it again. He that believeth upon the Son has everlasting life. Uh -huh. And he that believeth not the Son shall not see life, Ooh. but the wrath of God abide upon him. Ooh, hey. Ray. Hey. Ray. Let's, let, let's give you some conversion of the Gentiles. Give me St. John 4, Ray. St. John 4. Mm -hmm. And let's see how the Lord treats the stranger. St. John 4, pick it up at verse 5. Mm -hmm. This is Jesus. Go ahead. Then come if he to a city of Samaritans, yes. which is called Sychar, yes. near the apostle of Now, ground. Samaria was the Gentiles had begotten. The Gentiles had taken over because the Assyrians had put them there. Mm -hmm. The Assyrians had put and scattered the nine tribes. Samaria was the capital of northern Israel. Mm -hmm. Jerusalem was the capital of southern Israel, which was where the Jews of Benjamin, Levi, and Judah, the main three, occupied. Mm -hmm. Come on, Ray. Near the parcel of ground that Jacob gave to his son Joseph. Now Jacob's well was there. Jesus, therefore, being weary with his journey, uh -huh. sat thus on the well, uh -huh. and it was about the sixth hour. Go ahead. The, the sixth hour is what? Uh, 12 o'clock midday. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. There comes uh -huh. a woman of Samaria to draw water. Jesus said unto her, uh -huh. Give me the drink. Give me what? I, I like the way he said it. Do that again, Ray. Give me the drink. Ooh, it tingles me. Go ahead, brother. <laughs> For the disciples were gone away into the city to yeah. buy meat. Yes. Thus said the woman of Samaria to him. Now, now people talking about you don't probably be talking to them. At that time, sisters and brothers, the New Church, Testament church was forming. And Jesus had to kickstart his priest first. Then once he trained them, then he launched them on the whole world. Mm -hmm. But Jesus talked to them first. Watch this, Ray. Go ahead. How is it that thou being a Jew? As is drink of me, which am a woman of Samaria. Uh -huh. For the Jews have no dealing with the Samaritans. Because Israel didn't teach nobody but Israel at that time. That's right. Because the Lord had to kickstart his priests. Go ahead. Jesus answered and said unto her, Yes. If thou knewest the gift of God. Yes. And who it is that saith yes. to thee. Yes. Give me the drink. Uh -huh. Thou wouldest have asked of him. Uh -huh. And he would have given thee living water. Now we're going we gonna to show you this living water in a few more minutes. What this real living water really is. Wait, give me verse 9. Mm -hmm. You want verse 9? Yes, sir. Give me verse 9. Then said the woman of Samaria to uh -huh. him. Uh -huh. How is it that thou being a Jew? Uh -huh. I messed that up, Ray. Mm -hmm. I messed that up. Uh, skip down to... Verse 11. Go ahead. Okay. Yeah. And the woman said unto him, Sir, uh -huh. thou hast nothing to draw with, uh -huh. and the well is deep. Yeah. From which then hast thou that living water? Go ahead. Now, Jesus is talking spirit, but she's thinking carnal. Mm -hmm. What she see, what she feel, oh, the water that she's looking at. Come mm -hmm. on, Ray. I thought greater than our father, Jacob. And see, she didn't know. She thinks she's an Israelite. Mm -hmm. But the bottom line is, she is a, a Gentile that had been, how you say, proselytized. There you go. Come on, Ray. Which gave us the well and drank thereof himself uh -huh. and his children and his cattle. Now Jesus finna go spiritual on her because he's giving her this living water now. Come on, Ray. And Jesus answered and said unto her, Yes. Whosoever drinketh of this water shall thirst again. Go ahead. But whosoever drinketh of the water that I shall give him uh -huh. shall never yeah. thirst. Shall never thirst. But the water that I shall give him uh -huh. shall be in him a well of water springing up into everlasting this life. This is the word of God that can get you salvation. He's talking about the word. Jesus told you in St. John 6 and 63, the words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. That's what the book said. Man, look what she did, Ray. Give me verse 15. The woman said unto him, sir, uh -huh. give me this water. Yes. That I thirst not, neither come here to draw. Whoa, give, give me this water. This is spiritual water. Verse 19, Ray. 19? Yes. The woman said unto him, sir. Uh -huh. Jesus told her her history and her activity. Then, now look what she said. See, Israel, record, the stranger recognized sovereign, sovereignty, but we don't. Come on, Ray. 
I perceive that thou art a prophet. I perceive that, I, that thou art a prophet. Wait, That's 24. Right. That's right. 24. God is a spirit. Yes. And they that worship him must well, worship him in spirit mm -hmm. and in truth. That's Come on, right. Ray. Look what the woman understood that our people today don't understand. Come on, Ray. The woman said unto him, Yes. I know that the Messiah coming. I know. I know everybody was looking for Jesus. Go ahead, Ray. We just called Christ. Yes. And when he has come, what are we going to do? He will tell us all things. Come on, Ray. Jesus said unto her, I that speak unto thee am he. I Ooh. that speak unto thee am he. He's telling her all things. Jesus is speaking to a Gentile. Mm -mm -mm. Huh. Ray, continue. Continue. And upon this came his disciples and marveled that he talked with the woman. Uh -huh. Yet no man said, what seekest thou? Uh -huh. Why talkest thou with her? Then what did the woman do? Watch, the, watch this, Ray. Let me show you some faith right here. Come on. The woman then left her water pot and went her way into the city and yes. said unto the men. Yes. Come, yes. see a man which told me all things that ever I did, and and not this to Christ? Wait, what did they do? Then they went out of the city and came unto him. So they came there, the Gentiles coming to Jesus. This is the, they in the city of Sychar, a city of Samaria. Wait, give me verse 41. Mm -hmm. And many more believed because of his own word. Man, I'm sorry, 39, Ray. I'm sorry, 39. And many of the Samaritans of that city believed on you him. You mean the Gentiles believed on him? For they, for the saying of the woman which testified, he told me all that ever I did. Everything that I did. But wait, give me 41 and 42. Look at this faith right here. Look at this. Go and, ahead. And many more believed because of his own word. They were converted. They believed. Come on, Ray. And said unto the woman, uh -huh. now we believe. Now we believe. That's right. Not because of thy saying, uh -huh. for we have heard him ourselves. Yes. And know that this is indeed the Christ. The Savior of the world. Recognize. Savior of the world. The Savior. The Gentiles is confessing. He told you every knee shall bow and every tongue going to confess. This is a preliminary here. Mm -hmm. Let's look at it from another point of view. Luke. I got Luke 7. Luke 7, sisters mm -hmm. and brothers. Luke 7. The conversion of the Gentile. Luke 7. And wait, when you get it, pick it up. We go on 7, 1 to 10. I don't want to cut this. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't want to cut this. If I get in trouble, so be it. Let me go down and fight you. <laughs> Luke 7, 1 through 10. Luke 7. Debbie. Come on, come on, come on. Now, when he had ended all his sayings in the audience of the people, uh -huh. he entered into Capernaum. And what then? And a certain centurion servant was dear unto him, uh -huh. was sick and ready to die. This is a centurion, a Roman citizen. Remember, Jerusalem is in captivity now to the Romans. Come on, Ray. And when he had heard of Jesus, he sent unto him a stranger, the elders of the Jews, yes. teaching him that he would come and heal his servant. Because he believed that he could do it. He had been told. Queen of Sheba was told. Mm -hmm. But she said, I didn't believe it until I came to see for myself. We're talking about eyewitnesses That's here, right. Ray. I know. Come on, Ray. And when they came to Jesus, they besought him instantly, instantly. saying, Instantly. That he was worthy, that he was worthy of whom he should do this. The Jews, the leadership of the Jews said, "This man is worthy that you can do this for him." Mm -hmm. A stranger? Go ahead, Ray. For he loved our nation, and he have built us a synagogue. Wait a minute, he loved our nation. That means he was good to Israel. Yes, sir. See, in every captivity, the Lord has been merciful. Daniel and them had favor. Right. Mordecai, Esther had favor in all our captivities. Right. We've always had favor. The only time we blew the favor when we blew the mission, when we stepped outside of our boundaries. Mm -hmm. Come on, Ray. Then Jesus went with them, and when he was now not far from the house, uh -huh. the centurion sent friends to him, saying unto uh -huh. him, Lord, trouble not thyself. Yes. For I am not worthy that thou shouldest enter under my roof. Man. Mm -hmm. Wherefore, Ooh. neither I thought myself worthy to come unto Ooh. thee, but say. This is, this is how I honor him. I ain't, I'm not worthy to come to you. Mm -hmm. But saying in a word, and my servant shall be healed. Ooh, why, Ray? For I also am a man set 
under authority, uh -huh. having under me soldiers. Yes. And I say to one go and to he go up, uh -huh. and to another come and he cometh. Uh -huh. And to my servant do this and he do appear. Go ahead, Ray. And when Jesus heard these things, he marveled at him uh -huh. and turned about and said unto the people that followed, uh -huh. I say unto you, uh, yes. I have not found so great a faith. Yes. No. Not in Israel. And now when we try to uh, uh, try to do the faith <laughs> and keep the law's commandments, they call us legalists. <laughs> Man, and, and, and a cult. I'm going to tell you something. We the most Bible reading this cult you ever seen. You better know him. Come to the Israel of God. We'll teach you. Come on. All are welcome. Mm -mm. All are welcome. Mm -hmm. Get your book. Get your paper. If you're a woman, get your head. Come, come on, sit down. Not we'll teach patience. you. We don't teach hate. We teach all inclusive. Line up with the scriptures and get eternal life. Get eternal life. What happened there, Ray? And they that were sick, returning to the house, uh -huh. found the servant whole yeah. that, he, that had been sick. So Jesus healed a centurion's servant. Mm -hmm. Healed the man. And you tell me, I can't preach to the Gentiles? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm going to preach to them. I'm going to sit with them. I'm going to have lunch with them. You understand? I'm going to teach them the gospel. That's I'm going right. to do my job. I'm going to live peacefully with them. You know why? Because when the power go out, the Gentiles is out there on the pole fixing it. <laughs> When the streets is messed up, the Gentiles is out there fixing it. Mm -hmm. You understand? Oh, by the way, he signed my check. I ain't kissing no butt. I'm giving his, his honor. I'm rendering under Caesar what Caesar. I'm going to pay my taxes. I ain't going to try to teach. I ain't going to try to scam. I'm going to render under Caesar what is Caesar, and I'm going to render unto God what is God. That's right. The book says. That's all, book right there. All, Did we finish yeah, that race? St. John 10 and 14 is where no, we at. 10 and 14? That's good. Let's go to St. John 10, 14 and 16. Two script. Yeah, go ahead, brother. I am the good shepherd. Yes. And know my sheep. And know my sheep. And I'm known of mine. And I'm known of mine. As the Father knoweth me, uh -huh. even so know I the Father. Uh -huh. And I lay down my life for the sheep. And I right. lay down my life for the sheep. Uh -huh. Ray, what verse is that? We at 16 now. Man, we at 16 now? Yes, we read it. it. We got to read it. And other sheep I have, uh -huh. which are not of this fold. What? Them also I must bring. A brother told me that these other sheep is Israel. Mm -hmm. I said, it can't be. It can't be. Because Israel is the fold, but it's always been a big multitude. The Lord, what did he say? Jesus said, go out. Compel the stranger. Mm, go yep. to the highways and the byways right. and bid them all to come to the wedding. That's right. And he said, hey, it's a, a small thing that you go out. And gather the tribe. What are you gonna do? Israel. What are you gonna do, he Ray? Said, I'm gonna send you to get the Gentiles that uh -huh. you might be my salvation until the ends of the Ooh. earth. That's right. Oh my goodness. He said, other sheep that I have that are not of this fold, them two I must bring. Let me show you these other sheep. Oh, by the way, before I show you the other sheep, let's go to Deuteronomy 10 chapter. Mm -hmm. Let's go there. Now, we read the book. Listen. We read the book. Your problem is not with Brother Julius, Brother Ray, Brother Will. Your problem is not with, your problem is with what's written in this book. You don't want to have a problem with God. Man, Julius. You don't want to have a problem with not God. We're going to read the book. Out of uh, the Torah, out of the law. Deuteronomy 10, Ray. Mm -hmm. Ray. What verse? Deuteronomy 18. 10. Give me 17, brother. Mm -hmm. Deuteronomy 10. Seven, we going 17, Marty. We going 17 through 19. I'm throwing this in. I'm throwing this one in, Latoya. Come on. For the Lord your God is God of God. Yes. Lord of Lord, a great God and a mighty and a terrible, which regard of not person. He don't have a reason. We read that in the Old Testament and the New Testament that Jesus is not a respecter of persons. We read. Lord, take a reward. Go ahead, Ray. He do have execute the judgment of the father. Yes. And the widow. Yes. And loveth the stranger. And what? And loveth the stranger. That's the non-Israelite. And giving him food and raiment. Yes. Love ye therefore the strangers. Love the strangers. Brothers, I'm telling you, you error in your doctrine. I heard it 30 years ago, and you have not graduated. Read all the book. This is the old time. This is in your Torah. Love the stranger. Ray. For ye were strangers in the land of Egypt. And the Lord found you in the waste house of the wilderness. That's right. And mm -hmm. built you up. 
Mexican How nation. dare Not you close. say don't teach the strangers? That's right. Lord said you been naked, I spray my skirt over you. Therefore, Ray, read that again. Love you, therefore, what, 19? Love you, therefore, the strangers. Uh -huh. For ye were strangers in the land of Egypt. Let's see how the Lord feel about the strangers. Isaiah the 56th chapter. That's where right. I knew he was going to go there. Yeah, I'm going there. Yeah, I'm going to read it. That's right. We were strangers. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of this folly. Well, like Brother Julie, you're compassionate. Yeah. The Lord is angry, sisters and brothers. I'm sick of this captivity too. But guess what? At least I understand it. And I understand that I can't do nothing about it but learn about how to oh, uh, unoffend my God. Mm -hmm. And that is to serve him in uprightness, in the right mind. Because that mind that you, got, that you got, you go into the wilderness if you're blessed, but you ain't coming out. I said it because I can read it. Kaleem Hill said, like boxing, they just need to throw in a towel. Hey, man. Right. It's all that time. simple. It's all that simple. <laughs> to my right. brother Bowie, too old. We are products of brother Bowie. That's right. So you want young lives? Here we are. Isaiah 56, verse 1 through 3, Ray. Thus said the Lord. But that said who? Thus said the Lord. Come on. Keep ye judgment. Yes. Do justice. Yes. For my salvation is near to come. Yes. And my righteousness to be revealed. Uh huh. Blessed is the man that doeth this. Blessed is Israel. Blessed is the man that doeth this. Yes. And the son of man that layeth hold on it. Yes, sir. That keepeth the Sabbath from polluting it. Oh, just like the Passover, the Gentile can keep the Sabbath. Yes, he can. Sister Debbie, my sister is sitting right here. Yes, she is. is my sister. Yes. The sister in Alaska, the Native American, in a, the Native Alaskan in, in the IOG Anchorage class, she is my sister. That's yes, right. Is. Because who is my mother and my sister and my Those brother? Who do the will. Those who hear my word and do it. And do the will of my That's father. my brother. That's and that's my sister. sister. That's right. That's my brother. And that's my sister. My goodness. Wait, what verse was that? Blessed is the man that doeth this. Yes. And the son of man that layeth hold on it. Yes. That keepeth the Sabbath from polluting it. Uh -huh. And keepeth his hand from doing any evil. Come on, Ray. Neither let the son of the stranger. The son of the stranger? The Lord say, love the stranger. Come on. That have joined himself to the Lord, speak, yes. saying, The Lord have utterly separated me from his people. Yes. Neither let the eunuch say, Behold, I am a dry tree. Ray, six to eight. Ray, six to eight. Ray, six to eight. Six to eight. Yes. Also the sons of the stranger yes. have joined themselves to the Lord. Yes. To serve him and to love the name of the Lord. Read that in your apocrypha. I said read it. It ain't there. Read, Ray. To be a servant. Yes. Everyone that keepeth the Sabbath from polluting it. Yes. And take a hold of my covenant. What are you going to do, Ray? Even them will I bring to my holy mountain. Yes, sir. And make them joyful in my house of prayer. Why, Ray? Their burnt offerings and their sacrifices shall be accepted upon mine own. Yes. For mine house shall be called a house of prayer for all people. Because he told you in my father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I wouldn't have told you. God can't lie. Just like he told me I should surely die and I can look at the graveyards. If he tell me that salvation, that he going to give you salvation, I got to believe that. I am compelled to believe that, sisters and brothers. Because he can't lie. Finish your race. The Lord God which gathered the outcasts of Israel said, Yes. Yet will I gather others to him. Yes. Beside those that I gathered he unto him. He told you that I got other sheep that are not of this fold. Them too I must bring. That's right. What man. book are you reading, my brothers? That's right. I exhort it to you. Please, change while you have time. Because if you don't, you are going to end up on the negative end of prophecy. Mm -mm -mm. Repent while you can. And serve the Lord with righteousness and mercy and truth, sisters and brothers. Oh, my God, Ray. Man, give me, give me Acts, the 13th chapter. I got three places after this. Acts 13. Thank you, sisters and brothers, for, uh, man, this is, this is near and dear because my heart is broken with me, within me, sisters and brothers, for my Hebrew Israelite brothers. I love your zeal, brothers, but the doctrine is antique. I heard it 30 years ago, even 40 years ago. I'm not a spring chicken in this. All I am is a watchman in the morning. Lindsay said we got to read, uh, Matthew 8, 11 through 12. Matthew 8? When we get when we get a chance, he wanted mm -hmm. to read that. Okay, my brother. Thank you, brother, for those scripts. Acts 13. 
Remind me again, Will. Acts, thir Acts 13, Ray, pick it up at verse 16. Acts 13 and 16. When you get it, go ahead. Then Paul stood up and beckoned with his hand and said, uh -huh. Men of Israel, yes. ye that fear God, give order. Yes. The God of this people of Israel chose our fathers yes. and exalted the people when they dwelt as strangers in the land of Egypt. Uh -huh. And with a high arm brought he them out of it. Paul is rehearsing Israel history from the time that it came up out of Egypt up until his present time. Mm -hmm. Skip down, but we're not going to read all that. On your own, you read it. Skip down to verse 26, Ray, mm -hmm. and we'll go ahead. Men and brethren. Men and brethren. Listen to what he's saying. First, men, that's strangers, and then the brethren, Israelites. Among the strangers, because Israel is scattered. Come on, Bray. Children of the stock of Abraham. Yes. And whosoever among you feareth God. Whosoever See, what, Ray? Whosoever among you feareth God. Did we read that earlier? Whoever among you that feareth God? Mm -hmm. what, 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 Ray, what? To you is the word of this salvation. Sin. So salvation is for everybody. 38 and 39, my brother. Mm -hmm. 38 and 39. Sisters and brothers, just thank you for the overtime. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It gets better. Watch this. Watch this. Ray, 38 and 39. Be it known unto you, therefore, men and brethren. Listen there. That's two sets of people, men and brethren. Go ahead. That through this man is preached uh -huh. unto you uh -huh. the forgiveness of sin. Uh -huh. And by him all that believe are justified from all things. Yes. From which he could not be justified by the law of Moses. The law of Moses was animal sacrifice. It could never take away your sins. The blood of Jesus. The book said it was not possible that the blood of goods, bulls, and goats That's could take away sin sins. as set in the ordinance of the law given by Moses. That's right. It couldn't. You, the fringes cannot take away your sins. You don't need it, sister, brother. Wear them if you want to. But if you're going to wear them, remember you're operating under the old covenant. Got to go right. back to sacrificing the animals. You can't do a partial. You got to do all of it. You got to go back to sacrificing the animals. You got to, oh, by the way, where's your waters of purification? That's right. You got to have all that. You got to have the phylactery. You got to have the arm strapped. Oh, by the way, you can't wear two different garments with, with your fringes. You can't do it. Wait, what verse? We in Romans 3. Man, do we, uh, do we finish that? We finished it. No, we didn't. We didn't? No, we, we're going to Romans 3 right now. Yeah, we, no, we're going. We did the 38, 39. We did it. Okay. Give me verse 47. 47 yeah. in Acts? Yeah. Oh, you'll just cut off here. That's why I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. oh, 47. Forgive uh, me, brother. Acts, Acts, Acts. Where we're at now? We're Acts 13. Okay. No, we got to get. We can't miss this way. Uh-huh. Because we got some people here finished make some changes in their life. Where we at now? 47. 47. 47. Uh-huh. For so have the Lord commanded us, saying. Uh, 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 uh. This is too heavy. Uh, mm. 42, 42, that's what I want, 42. And when the Jews were gone out of the synagogue, uh -huh. the Gentiles besought that these words might be preached Who? to them the Who? next Sabbath, the Gentiles. And then what happened, Ray? Now when the congregation was broken up, many of the Jews and religious proselytes followed Paul and Barnabas, who, speaking to them, persuaded them to continue in the grace go of ahead, God. Go ahead, go ahead, Ray. And the next Sabbath And day, the next Sabbath, and not next Sunday... Listen, not next Sunday. Sunday is the first day of the week named after the sun. That's right, brother. Sunday is for sun worshipers. Google it. Encyclopedia, Wikipedia, it's all there. The origin of Sunday. I dare you to Google it. And if it don't line up with the scriptures, time to graduate mm -hmm. to the truth. The four commandments, the only one that starts we remember. Remember the Sabbath day and keep it holy. Sister told me today that, well, I go to church every day. I say, that's good, but it's not every day, not the Sabbath day. Read, anyway, Ray. And the next Sabbath day yes. came almost the whole city together to hear the word of God. But now look what's happening today, today, as it did back then. Always Israel. Always Israel. Look what we do, Ray. But when the Jews saw the multitudes, they were filled with envy and speck against those things which were spoken by Paul, uh -huh. contradicting and blaspheming. And that's what we do. Didn't, didn't we read earlier that the name that the name of Jesus is blasphemed among by you? That's right. You taught the Gentiles how to blaspheme against God. Man, 47, Ray. Uh, 46, go ahead. Then Paul and Barnabas waxed bold and, and this said, why, And this is why, oh, we waxing bold tonight. Mm -hmm. This is why I'm waxing bold. I'm taking my station. I ain't scared. I'm taking my station. If 
If I die, I die. I know that my Savior gonna raise me up again. Know my Redeemer live. And I know my right. Redeemer live. That's and right. I'm gonna see him mm -hmm. with my own eyes. That's right. And no, not another. Mm -hmm. Ray. Then Paul and Barnabas waxed bold and said, uh -huh. It was necessary that the word of God should first have been spoken to you. But what, Ray? But seeing ye put it from you and judge yourselves unworthy of everlasting life. Better change. No. We turn to the Gentiles. Why, Ray? Why? Why do we have to turn to the Gentiles? For so have the Lord commanded us, saying, uh -huh. I have set you to be a light of the Gentiles. I have set thee, because the Lord said, go and preach all na to all nations. Mm -hmm. And when they hear you and when they see your behavior, they're going to say, surely, this is a wise and understanding people. That's but right. now, if they see you sagging and you see in your neighborhood and you see they see your kids and got no kind of a respect for the elders, what kind of wisdom is that? I know. Wait, 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 wait. Well, Jer Brother Jude, you shouldn't judge. What I'm talking about ain't none compared to what the Lord judgment is going to be. That's right. Wait. For so have the Lord commanded us, saying, I have set thee to be a light of the Gentiles. Yes, sir. That thou shouldest be for salvation unto the ends of the earth. Ooh. And when the Gentiles heard And this, when the Gentiles heard they were glad. Because it is when they going to be glad. Why, Ray? That's right. And glorified the word because of the Lord. Because ain't nobody left out. And as many as were ordained to eternal life, believe. You mean That's the Gentile right. were ordained unto eternal, eternal life? Yes, sir. Let's look at it. Romans, the third chapter. Book Two say, places after this. The book said, them that were bid for the wedding were not found worthy. Jesus. They were not found worthy. Mm -hmm. That was Israel. The scripture mm -hmm. said, Ray, that you're going to see Abraham. And Isaac and Jacob yes. sitting down. In the kingdom of God, but yes. he yourself shall be thrust out. out. That's right. That's a horrible thing that the priests end up in a lake of fire. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's a horrible thing that the priests, Israel, end up in a lake of fire. Mm -hmm. When you supposed to be on top. That's right. He prepared this wedding for his his servants, Israel. Oh, my God. Because they were, they were not found worthy to eat this wedding, Julius. They said some, some men returned back to their farms. And so they good. Mm -hmm. He said, now go out to the highways and the byways. And, and bring them. Bring mm -hmm. them in. Just some strangers. That dude. my father's house might be full. He said that the That's wedding right. may be furnished, right? right? Man, That's Romans right. 3, 1 and 2, Ray. That's right. Romans man. 3, 1 and 2. We, we just about out. Come on, Ray. What advantage then have the Jew? What advantage right. is you being a Jew? That's, That's right. a good question. Who asked that? But people abuse this right here. You abuse it, Ray. Or oh, what profit is there of circumcision? Much in every way. Why? Chiefly because that unto them were committed the oracles of God. Listen, listen, listen. The Lord gave up. We the priests of the whole world. Mm -hmm. And I magnify my office. I ain't scared. Ask me a question. I'm going to take the book and answer. If I can't answer you, I'll seek higher counsel on it. We got elders. In. I got an elder right here. I got Brother Yama. I got the senior pastor, Brother Bowie. I could call him. I could go to him. He's yes. approachable. That's yes. right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But bring your book. Bring your book. Bring your book. Come on. But what if some did not listen, believe? Listen, my brothers. Listen, my brothers. So if you don't want to do your job, you don't believe? Go ahead, Ray. Shall their unbelief make the faith of God without effect? Listen, you can't stop prophecy. Prophecy is going to be fulfilled whether you serve him or not. That's right. Prophecy is going to be fulfilled. Man, why, Ray? God forbid. Uh huh. Yea, let God be true. Uh huh. But let every man a liar, mm -hmm. as it is written, that thou mightest be justified in thy saying, uh -huh. and mightest overcome when thou art dead. But just in case you got a little something on your mind that you ain't going to hear this lesson tonight, and that you're not going to abide by the words of this lesson tonight, skip down to verse 9 and read it, Ray. Got some for you, sisters and brothers. I got some for you right here. The Lord got some for you. Come on, Ray. What then? Yes. Are we better than they? You ain't better than the Gentiles. That's no. Right. In no way. In no way. Matter of fact, we worse. The books that we have whacked worse than our fathers. Great. For we have before proved both Jews and Gentiles yes. that they are all under sin. Why, right. Ray, at verse 23? Why? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. For all have seen. Oh, no, no, no. Just, the, just Israel. All. For all have seen. All of the sons of Adam have sinned. Go ahead, Ray. And come short of the glory of God. That's why Jesus had to come. He said, then they that hated me were more than the hairs of my head. He said, but then I came and I restored that which I took not away. Adam killed us. That's right. Jesus, the second Adam, came and restored us back to a way of salvation. Don't blow the mission this time. 
Do not blow the mission this time. 29. Watch this. Like we read in Deuteronomy, the 10th chapter, Love the Stranger. Deuteronomy, this is Romans. Paul finna tell you in his day and time. And I'm saying it in our day and time. 29. Is, is he the God of the Jews is only? He, is he the God of the Jews only? Yes. Is he not also of the Gentiles? What the book say? What the book say? Yes. Yes. Of the Gentiles also. Of the Gentiles also. 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 30 way. Seeing it is one God which one God. justify the circumcision by faith. The Jews by faith. And the uncircumcision through faith. Because he right. told the centurion, I have not seen such great faith. No, not in Israel. Right. We read the book. We read the book. Last place. And then I got a special scripture for Elizabeth book. Revelation, the seventh chapter. Mm -hmm. Cl I'm going to close out with this one. Matter of fact, matter of fact, let's go to where he wanted, um, Will. This for, this for you, Brother Booker. This for you. Matthew, the eighth chapter. This for you, brother. I love you. We call you the share master. You want to do uh What verse he want me to do? Uh, uh, let's start with verse 10. Ray, Ray just quoted it, but this one, you want to read this. Okay, you got it, Ray. When Jesus heard it, he marveled and said to them that follow, uh -huh. Verily I say unto you, Yes. I have not found so great a faith. Yes. No, not in Israel. Right. See, the reason why I didn't go to this one is because it's the same story, but in one of them, the uh, it showed you that the service came, mm -hmm. but then in the other one it said that the man, the centurion soldier himself came. Mm -hmm. But it's the same thing, brother. Yep. It's the same thing that we read in Luke, verse eleven. Go ahead. And I say to you, uh -huh. that many shall come from the east and the west. Yes. And shall sit down with Abraham and Isaac and Jacob. Yes. In the kingdom of heaven. He said many. Go ahead, Ray. Right. But the children of the kingdom shall be cast out into outer darkness. That's Israel. And there shall be weeping and gnashing of teeth. You want to throw away the stranger? And you want to make her kiss your feet? You better be careful before you be like uh, your daddy to the devil. Mm -hmm. You want to be like Satan? He burning? You going to burn too. Man, ain't no glory in that. Last place. Thank you, my brother. That's right. Revelation, the seventh chapter. And thank you, sisters and brothers, for tuning in to another edition of the Bomb and Gilead Bible Radio Show. This is our last script, and I'm going to turn it back over to Brother Will. And if Brother Ray wants to come in, feel free. Revelation 7, and pick it up 2 to 4. Revelation 7, 2 to 4. When you get it, go ahead. And I saw another angel sending from the east. Yes. Having the seal of the living God. Yes. And he cried with a loud voice to the four angels. Yes. To whom he was given to hurt the earth and the sea. Yes. Saying, hurt not the earth, neither the sea, nor yes. the tea. Yes. Till we have sealed the servants of our God in their foreheads. See, you got to be sealed. That that's seal right. is the knowledge that's the Lord that put in your inward man, in the inward man. That's right. That's the transform of your mind. Right. You're sealed with the word of God. It's the understanding right. of the word of God, which is the Holy Spirit in you. Right. Oh, my goodness. Come on, Ray. What mm -hmm. verse? Four. Go ahead, brother. And I heard the number of them which were sealed. In that region, go ahead. And there was sealed 140 and 4,000 of all the tribes of the children of Israel. I love Jehovah's Witnesses, but you got it wrong here. Mm -hmm. You said that it's only going to be 144,000. You got to keep reading, sisters and brothers. Oh, by the way, that doctrine, Jehovah's Witness, it comes out of the Adventist movement. It's a Gentile doctrine, and you can trace it all the way back to Rome. Go and research it. Remember, the oracles was given to Israel. We know where everybody come from. All the doctrines, all the religions. And 144,000, every last one of them was Israel. That what the book say? Read it again. 44. Let the book, what the book say, Ray? And I heard the number of them which were sealed. Uh -huh. There were sealed 140 and 4,000 uh -huh. of all the tribes of the children but of it Israel. Ain't, but it ain't over. It ain't over. It's not over, Ray. Verse 9. After this, uh -huh. I beheld and lo a great multitude, which no man could number. Now, now, to the Jehovah Witnesses that came up and told me only 144,000 are going to be saved, if it's going to be only 144,000 that's going to be saved, what number are you? You might mm -hmm. well, I told the brother Julius, you might as well give on up. If you're talking about from the beginning, a man, only 144,000. Uh, hey, think so about it. You that, might as well give up now. You got to understand this scripture. That is those in that region, sister brother. That's right. That come out of great that come out of that place. We're going to show you that the book. What the That's book right. say, Ray? 
Out of this I beheld and lower great multitude uh -huh. which no man could number. You could number 144,000. Stop putting God in the box. Of all nations and kindreds and people and tongues. Of all nations. My Hebrew brothers. Read the book. All of it. Mm -mm. Read the book. All of it. You don't want to accept this? Time going to tell everything. Woe unto you if you end up on the wrong side of prophecy. Man, Lord, keep me. Keep me, your spirit, in me. That's what I pray for, Will. Come on, come on, Ray. Of all nations and kindreds and people and tongues yes. stood before the throne and before the Lamb. Yes. Clothed with white robes uh -huh. and palms in their hands. And what did they say, Ray? And they cried with a loud voice saying, Salvation to our God which yes. sitteth upon the throne and to the Lamb. And all the angels stood round about the throne yes. and about the elders and the four beasts and fell before the throne on their faces and worshiped God. And worshiped God. Wait, 13 and 14. Come on, brother. And one of the elders answered and said unto him, Uh huh. What are these? What are these? That are arrayed in white robes. Yes. And whence came they? Come on, Ray. And I said unto him, Sir, thou knowest. And what did he say, Ray? And he said unto me, These are they Ray. which are came out of great, great tribulation. tribulation. How much of the world is. Great tribulation is going to affect. Oh, that oh. means all nations. That's right. But God is so merciful that whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Shall be saved. Start at the top of that again, 14. And I said unto him, Sir, thou knowest. And he said unto me, These are they which came out of great tribulation and have washed their robes and made them white in the blood of the Lamb. And have made them white in the blood of the Lamb. Sisters and brothers, for the sake of time, I won't go to wrong, to Daniel the sixth chapter. On your own, if you manage Gentiles, read Daniel the sixth chapter and watch how Darius. Yep. You want to see pictures of the Gentiles? These are pictures of the Gentiles. I got this here. This is Nebuchadnezzar II, Gentile, called Dan, European. This is Darius the first, the Medo. This is the first world ruling. This is the first world ruling. Gentile ruled that ruled the whole known world at that time. Nebuchadnezzar the second. Okay? He is the lion that come out of the thicket. The destroyer of the Gentiles. In other words, he's from the Gentile dynasty. Mm -hmm. You have Darius. You have Darius the first. Darius the Mede. In order. The Babylonians, the Medo Persians. The Mede, sisters and brothers. You had Darius the first. Or Darius the Great, the Mede. Of the Achaemenian Empire. You had Cyrus. The Persian. We call him Iranians today. Sisters and brothers. This is Cyrus the second. Cyrus the great. Gentile. Look at him. Gentiles. Europeans. We got a bust right here. Here's a bust of Alexander the great. The third world ruler empire. The Greeks. Alexander the Greeks. And his four generals took out of. Came out of him sisters and brothers. Alexander the great. And now, this is who's ruling the world right here. Him, this is who we ain't known. I ain't going to put no face on him. But look at it and you tell me if this ain't that fourth that dreadful and terrible beast that came, that was prophesied to rise and fall ten times. That's right. Now we wait. He got his office. Now we wait on the political head, the beast to come. It must be church and state. Beasts and false prophets. You have heard the conversion of the Gentiles. It fails me for the time to talk about how Naaman was converted. That's right. How Ahasuerus was converted. How Nebuchadnezzar praised and extolled the God of Israel. Mm -hmm. How Darius in Daniel the sixth chapter promoted Daniel. And not only that, sisters and brothers, made a decree and passed a law and said that whosoever don't serve Daniel's God, his house gonna be made a dung here. That was Nebuchadnezzar that said that. But Darius made a decree That's that right. he commanded that all nations, tongues, and languages serve Daniel's God. That's right. Listen, thank you for your time. I'm gonna turn it back over to our host tonight, Brother Will. Thank you for staying over time with us. I had to get that out. And again, like, share, and post. I love you. We'll see you next week. Who's who's teaching next week, Ray? Brother. Mm -hmm. Brother Ray. Here. Brother Ray? No, uh, Brother Jeremiah. Is teaching Jeremiah, Brother, Brother Jeremiah, Jeremiah is teaching, teaching next week, sisters and brothers, on the next episode of the Bomb of Gilead. I love you. I thank you for your time. Ray, any last words?
Greatness. Yeah. Oh, man. In the name of Jesus, thank you, bro. The harvest is past. Thank you, my elder here. Thank you for joining us. Bobby Gilead. A piece of advice for my brothers and sisters. No salvation for the Gentiles. It'd be a terrible, a great, terrible thing if you come before the throne and find out you're a Gentile yourself. Woo! That needs to be a terrible thing, brothers and sisters. You find out you're a Gentile. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. 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 Thank